Hey, what is going on everybody? Typical Toy Reviews back with another Game of Thrones Funko Pop review. Today we have number 11, Cersei Lannister, the original vaulted one in her red dress um, from the first couple seasons of the show. And this is from edition 2 of the Game of Thrones line, so a pretty early one back when they had Renly, who's uh, pretty much the most valuable one in the line now. Um, so real quick, look at the box. There's the back. Again, this came with 07 Jon Snow, then Rob Stark, Arya Stark, Jaime Lannister, Cersei Lannister, and Renly Baratheon, and they're all vaulted except for, I believe, Jon and Arya. Side of the box, number 11, classic view at the top. The other side, there she is in all of her likeness, and the standard bottom, but we'll go ahead and slide that in the back and go ahead and give you a closer look at the figure itself. Um, right away you'll notice this one is a very hefty figure. It's definitely um, solid. Unlike the newer version of Cersei here, Season 7 Cersei, from also I believe Edition 7 of the, the Game of Thrones Funko Pop line, she has a hollow head. This one's definitely solid filled, or at least um, her body might be uh, hollow too. This one's very light. Uh, this one's very heavy. Um, the camera doesn't pick it up very well, but this one looks like she almost has a tan, like the, the skin tone was painted on it. It's kind of strange. Uh, mine has a little bit of black paint messed around it, but um, the sculpt on the hair is pretty interesting. It almost looks like it, it would be like a proto, uh, the way it's it's finished. It looks like it almost should have been painted. Because if you like, look at the, the color of her hair on the box there versus... Um, what it actually is. It's like a very odd color. It doesn't look wrong or anything, but it just kind of looks weird to me, especially with the contrast of her almost orange face. Um, she's got the eyelashes, brown eyebrows, and the pointed nose. Her outfit is just a long red dress. She doesn't have any feet, so it sits flat like this, which was kind of a problem with the Season 7 one. It's at like a slight angle, so she leans forward and can fall over pretty easy. Um, she has a nice braid in her hair with a little different colored tie there. Uh, she's wearing two rings. Let me try to make sure this is focused. And a necklace. Uh, but then she's got a, a double brown belt and then the brown on her sleeves. Um, so it's all uh, definitely a better pop than the newer one in my opinion with the long hair, the red dress. This one's just pretty boring. She does have her orange uh, gem fire ring on and her shoulder pads and then obviously the crown. But with her short hair, it just doesn't look as great, in my opinion. The only thing I don't like about this one is the orange <laughs> the orange skin. Um, her head does turn a little bit. Some of the original ones, like uh, Ned Stark, doesn't really have much head motion, but she can at least turn a little bit. I believe this one is very, very minor turnability. Also, we got, for good measure, we got Mystery Mini Joffrey here. He actually goes very nice um, with these pieces. He's actually to scale pretty well for young Joffrey in his crown. He's pouty, he's got his arms on his sides just like his <coughs> mother. So, yeah, that was just a quick review of number 11, Cersei Lannister from the Game of Thrones line, edition 2, with a little bit of a quick look at edition 7, as well as the Joffrey mystery mini. So go ahead and uh, like the video if you liked it. Comment down below if you have any one of these three figures, and subscribe for more content. Uh, in the upcoming week, I'm going to be posting uh, uh, pretty much all one-a-day uh, Game of Thrones Funko Pop reviews. Uh, these are going to be older pops, so people may have done reviews on them in the past, but I still want to put them out there while I got the content, especially with Season 8 right around the corner coming out April 19th, I believe. Um, it'll be a good time to do these videos. So again, thanks all for watching, and see you guys in the next video.